our final speaker, Mali Bain, PDSP, MA student, community as a teacher. Um, first, I wanted to thank the Muscoon for welcoming us to their land. Um, and on the slide you see here, um, you can see an image of where I come from. Uh, my family is British, Scottish, and German, so that answers the last person's question. And I grew up on the territories of the Haida in Haida Gwaii, territories of the Kwakwakiwak on northern Vancouver Island, as you will see, and <laughs> uh, territories of the Muscoon and Coast Salish here in Point Grey in East Vancouver. So um, as far as I know, I'm the first person in my family, which has been here 130 years, I'm the first person to acknowledge Indigenous ownership of the land that we have owned and settled on for all of those years. And that is an important part of the work that I'm doing. So one element of my work in a Venn diagram on the top right corner uh, <laughs> is decolonization. So decolonization is an important theme in what I am doing myself, personal decolonization, as well as as a perspective on the program I'm studying. So I'm looking at decolonization and I'm also looking at what I call international service learning, the second element in the Venn diagram. Uh, I call this work international because it is between the sovereign colonial nation state, which we call Canada, and between the Stalo First Nation and the Fraser Valley, so a sovereign first nation on this land. So I consider it to be international service learning. When I say service learning, I mean a combination of community service with some kind of critical reflection. So I'm exploring that field. And the third field I'm exploring in the bottom of your Venn diagram is program planning. So I'm looking at what Sork will call the, the messiness of program planning as it happens in reality. And the case study I'm looking at is called Community as Teacher. It's a partnership between UBC and a group called Yothmeath, the Fraser Valley Child and Family Services Society. They've worked together for the last eight years and last year won an award for their partnership, working together to build a program that helps health sciences students learn about Indigenous context by being immersed for three days and three nights in a stall location community. I am studying this program by talking to program managers, um, asking them questions about how the program started, what the objectives of the program are, and where they see the program having applications in other contexts. I'm compiling their understandings and sharing that in my thesis. If you want to know the answers to the question, you'll have to read the thesis when it comes out, or you can chat with me afterwards as I'm in progress, um, and I'd be happy to talk to you after. Thank you.